Okay, what's up guys? It's your boy Tim Harrington. This is my first YouTube video, so bear with me. Today I'll be doing how to make college the best years of your life. Number one, remember why you are here. You're here to get an education. So with that being said, make sure you go to class every day. You know, that's something I didn't do my first semester. My first semester, I had a 199 GPA here at Ole Miss. Like, I was on academic probation. It was tough. It went tough. It just like I wasn't taking the academic part seriously. I was on everything else, you know, going out, not going to class, not talking to my professor, went asking for help, none of that. So now I got a 3-0, but I had to work my butt off to get that 3-0. So it's like you don't want to be in that position. Um, go Make sure you go to class, like I said. See your professors. They will help you. Like if you got an 88 and you need that 90, I promise you, they will help you if you've been talking to them the whole semester. So go talk to them. Get to know your professors. And the last one is you got to ask for help. Like, always ask for help. People are. There's so many resources. I know here at Ole Miss, there's resources here that can help you. So ask for help. Number two, surround yourself with people, you know, where you want to be in life. The people. Like, if they, like, for example, if you're trying to get a 4-0, you need to hang around people that got 4-0s. If you're trying to go to law school, you need to hang around people that are lawyers that are already in law school or trying to go to law school too. You know, you can still be cool with like everybody, but you just need to remember that you you the five, you the sum of five people that you hang around. So remember that. Um, number three, get healthy, dog. Like that's like the biggest thing. I wish I could get everybody to understand. Like your health is a big part in your success here in college. So you gotta, ex I exercise daily. Um, that's something I do to keep my mind clear, to keep me like in a good mood. Um, and, I, and I eat right. Once college started, I cut out pork and fried foods to keep me mentally uh, aware and just uh, on my game. You need to clean yourself mentally because when finals come, you're gonna be stressed. I promise you, you're gonna be stressed. So you just need to get a, make, make time for you to clean yourself mentally. Um, you need to get stronger spiritually, whatever your religion is. You know, I'm a Christian, but I know everybody not a Christian. So if you're a Muslim, you're an atheist, you a, a Buddhist, whatever you are, you need to just get stronger in your faith. Because I promise you, you're going to need a little bit more whatever you have. I'm gonna need, I needed a little bit more Jesus first semester with that 199. And sleep. Get, make sure you get enough sleep, dog. Like, that's a big thing. Like, you want to make sure that you are well prepared for your next day. So, don't be staying up every night. Uh, number four, this is my favorite one because this is something that I, like, perfected. Like, I socialize. Number four, socialize. Get to know everybody. Me, when I'm on campus, I'm going to smile and I'm going to speak to everybody I come across. I'm going to get to know you. That's just my gift. That's my passion. I love talking and networking. So, socialize. Speak to everybody. Get involved on campus. I know here at Ole Miss, it's like, all type of stuff you can get involved in. Like me, I'm involved with Mox, BSU, ASB. I played guitar for Gospel Car, but that was for a little bit. Um, I was in community council for Lucky Day. So just get involved with everything. You never know like what those organizations can lead for you down the road. So get involved and go to events. Go to football games. Go to the basketball games. You know, just just get it. Just go to just go to a lot of stuff. But also, don't do too much because then you're gonna be kind of like spread thin and you're gonna be tired. And the last one, number five, make some me time. Make time for yourself, cause I promise you, I promise you, dog. Like when finals come, you're gonna be like drained. You're gonna be stressed. Boyfriend, your girlfriend acting up, all of this stuff. Like you're gonna wish you could just. Detox. So make time for yourself. Me personally, I go to the gym and I go get my, my nails done, you know, my pedicure and my manicures. I get that done, get them taken care of. It's relaxing. So whatever you do, you ain't got to go to the gym or, or um, get your nails done. But that's something I do. So hopefully I got to help you guys. Um, if you like, comment and subscribe because I'm going to be able to do. I'm going to start doing more videos and more tips on just certain topics. So if you want tips on certain topics, let me know. Thank you. Um, I appreciate it.